Hey guys, alright, so I want to show you guys how I got this look. And, alright, I'm going to, like, tell you guys to keep in mind I'm not a professional. I'm just, you know, a girl doing what she likes to do. And so, if it's not, like, perfect, please, you know, keep in that in mind. I'm still working on, you know, gradually becoming better. So, I'm going to go ahead and get started. And this is actually a quite simple, you know, look to get. It's all, it's all, um drugstore and expensive brands so you guys can get this and the products are easy at and they're <laughs> easily accessible i don't know why but words are coming in my, out of my mouth in different directions so i'm gonna go ahead and get started um i've already primed my eye with urban decay primer potion so the next thing i'm gonna do is take my nyx jumbo eye pencil in 604 milk and it's just a plain white Jumbo eye pencil. It's very creamy. You want to get that all over the lid to make sure it's like it, the colors stick and become out more vibrant. And then I'm gonna blend it all over. I'm gonna set this aside for a minute later. And then next, I'm going to take this Maybelline um, Duo in Shocking Seas. And it was just, just really gorgeous colors of light blue and dark navy blue. And I'm going to take a flat shader brush. And I'm going to pick up that light blue first. And I'm going to pack that on all over the lid. Just so that color stands out a bit. And it's very pretty. Pretty. It's a nice, very light blue. And I can see myself wearing this to like the beach or to a, you know, a party or whatever I'm doing. And then next, I'm going to set this aside because I'm going to be coming back to that. I'm going to take my NYX single eyeshadow in ES116 wild the fire and this was in my latest Ulta haul and so I've been playing around finding what I can use this with and I'm hoping this is a winner so it's this very nice green color as I showed you before and then I'm going to take a small brush and I'm just going to take this and get it actually wrong but I'm gonna take a small brush I'm going to take this and get it all into the crease It's just a very nice green, dark, and it's kind of shimmery. And so that's what you got so far. Don't worry, you're gonna end up blending it all out. And then after that, I'm gonna set that. I'm gonna set that down because I'm done with that. I'm gonna take, go back to this Maybelline Duo, and I'm gonna take a smaller brush, such as this one, and I'm just gonna get that dark blue color on it. And I'm going to use that on the outer corner to make a V and try to define that outer corner a bit. And I'm actually going to take some of that color. Sorry, I was out of shot down onto my lower lash line to connect it all together. And then after that, I'm going to take a blending brush. And I'm actually going to take my CoverGirl Quad in Country Woods. I'm going to take this lightest shade right here. And I'm going to pick up and use as a highlight. I'm going to put it all under my eyebrow and I'm going to go down and I'm going to blend all these colors together so the lines aren't like harsh. And so, so far that's what you got. And it looks, honestly it looks better with, like, it looks better off camera because this is a really bad quality camera. So that's so far what you got. And then after that, I'm going to take my Hard Candy Walk the Line 
or no, is it off the line? I don't know, it's a hard candy eyeliner in Wild Child. And it's just like this glittery blue. And I'm going to go up and I'm going to line my lash line. And the one thing I don't like about these is you have to actually like work with them to try to get the color out. And make it actually line. But off camera, you can tell, like, there's a line and there's some glitter there. And then I come down and I take it and I line my waterline a bit. And so, and so that works, obviously. And then after that is done, I'm going to go and I take my NYX Jumbo Eyeshadow my pencil and milk again. I'm gonna take that into the inner tear duct just to brighten that area up a bit. I'm actually gonna even under both my eyebrows a little bit because I forgot to do that before. And I'm just gonna blend that up just to highlight that a bit more. And so we're almost complete. And the last thing you're gonna do is you're going to curl your eyelashes and and then I'm going to take my hard candy ginormous lash volumizing mascara in electric blue and that's the bristles and it's just it comes out way more blue on screen than it really is it's a very pretty blue And the thing I like about this mascara is it, like, from far away, it kind of looks black. So it doesn't look too crazy and too blue. But when you look it up really close, you can tell that it's blue. So that's what I like about it. And it just ties into this whole whatever. And lastly, just to finish off the lips, I'm going to take my Hard Candy Visibly Wet Shocking Glossy Lip Pencil in Beauty. And it's just this pinkish color. And it's just, like lip gloss and pencil honestly and this one's very nude and pinky so it doesn't really come up all that well much it's kind of darker pink than normal so that's that and ta-da that's my look um i hope you guys enjoyed it i had a lot of fun coming up with it and playing around my makeup and I was kind of hoping, considering I went out bought this, and I bought this just was like, okay, that's a really pretty color. I was hoping I could find something in my little stuff to, you know, blend it, or, well, you know, mix it with and make it a nice look. So, I hope you guys liked this, liked, liked this look. I hope you guys liked this look. If you're going to recreate it, go ahead and post that below in a video response. And if you have any questions, comments, or whatnot, leave them, and I will respond to them. Also, do not forget to subscribe because there will be more videos to come. Bye!